holovex can be viewed by multiple people from multiple angles. It is a true volumetric display like the holograms that we've seen in movies and science fiction for so long. I can see a future where every toggle, every control you have is going to be a projected volumetric entity. You'll have buttons, you'll have signs, there's, there's room in education and planning. Whenever you see a movie and there's a projection, it's always being used for very practical purposes. It's always being used to describe a uh, uh, large dimensional scene. Holovec is short for holographic vector display and it is a volumetric display system. It draws images in the air with light. And that technology does not exist. You can 3D print an object, but it will, it will take a long, long time and it's not interactive. Holographic vector display. <laughs> Okay. Turn it on by pressing uh, that button right here. Yep. Oh man, that is so, so cool. At its heart is an Edison microcontroller and you can load images to it via USB or, or Wi-Fi or Bluetooth. It's basically a computer, you can program it or you can actually code for it if you're advanced. With this technology you can, you can create landscapes, you can create scenery and, and move it and change it. You can create designs and see them come to life. An architect can make a building and actually see it without waiting for a maquette and then modify it to see it again. There's also a future where it can be used as a communication device. It is a first step but it can go far beyond uh, just a simple display. So it's a the SDK gives you all the tools you'll need to get started right out of the box. Take something very simple, a point in space, that is X, Y, and Z. And you take two of those, now you have a vector. You take a group of those, now you have an object. The SDK gives you the tools to manipulate an object in space with minimal programming skills. I have a degree in physics from Virginia Tech, and it's it light. It's it's one of the things that are really important to me. And this is an application of physics mostly and, and computer science. I also ha have a lot of experience manufacturing. Um, I design and build uh, solar power phone booths and street lights. I think there's few technologies that are as disruptive as crowdfunding and as important as Kickstarter. In the past, somebody like me with, with, with an idea and an invention would have to go through a very long, circuitous route to get funding. And this way, you know, I can produce an idea, make a product, and bring it directly to, to the people who will help me uh, develop it in the future. The idea is to get Holovex in the hands of as many people as possible, developers, programmers, artists, to see what they will come up with. And, and then we can develop it further, use that experience and that, that input to go to the next phase.